up, Dokoners? Welcome back to Toonrami for another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. We're going to be continuing the Toon Lock Challenge Parade, or phenomenon, whatever, uh, in the Legendary Goku event. I did this once on the Super Battle Road on my previous video, so check out that link in the description below if you want to see what this is all about. But basically, you cannot change your rotations whatsoever. So we tried the Super Battle Road with the same team. The reason why I had the STR Vegitos as the leads was because it was to showcase the units so having two of them in their lead roles was just another way to like you know give them more attention on this video we're gonna have the 55% lead Vegito and the 100% lead Vegito and some skill orbs so it's gonna be a nice uh, comparison also I don't have any links on my Vegito but this guy has six and seven so it's gonna be a pretty drastic difference so let's see how this team works once again, this is the Super Toon Lock, or I guess in this case, the Legendary Fighting Legend Toon Lock? It's a Toon Lock challenge, so no rotations can be changed. I saw one of you on Twitter <laughs> posted that you were unfortunately given both of the STR Vegitos in the same rotation, which is why I removed the no item restriction, because I actually wanted to do that at first, but I figured that would... that would de-incentivize a lot of players who don't necessarily have all of these units rainbowed out or duped out. This way, having the items included, it's more accessible and it's more attainable with people. Um, so that's why I did that. So we're going to be jumping in now, and I'm basically going to be trying this out for the first time. I'm not going to do this a second time or a third time. I'm trying it for the first time so that you guys can see what it's about. And then if you want to do it, you can. And you can see how I do on my very first attempt. That is it. But you can use all of your items. So pack up whatever items you need to get this done and see how far you can go. I'm adding the first try thing for myself. If you want to do a first try and compare, go for it. Or if you definitely want to make sure that you do better than me, do a second try, third try, fourth try, whatever you need. Just, you know, something to do, right? In these times on Global, or in Dokkan in general, some people have been saying that there's not as much stuff, which has been a bit of a surprise, but, you know, given the state of the world right now, it's sometimes... We, we have to take a step back and kind of just keep that in the back of our minds. This could potentially be a byproduct of the fact that you know, game developers are not able to roll out as much content as they necessarily want to. Oh, no, no, I'm not allowed to do that. I'm not allowed to do that. I forgot. Oof, I almost, I almost broke the rules on my own challenge. I can't do that. I have to keep... Oh, that sucks. Okay. So, I have no super from Vegito. Oh, no, I do, actually. He can use a super at 8 key, right? 9 key. At 9 key, he gets a super, so he's good. Um, no one else is probably going to go, so we might as well just boost our Dokkan gauge a little bit. I'm gonna see if I can do this no item, see how far I can go, but I don't know if I want to. Depending on how far this goes, we'll, we'll decide. Uh, so far, I haven't used an item, and I don't particularly want to, but we'll see. Because if I can get to, like, God or Goku Blue with no items, first try, Toon Lock, that would be actually pretty cool. The first try, I, I feel like the first try thing is very underrated. I don't think people understand the luck involved in a first try. So, that's another reason why I want to keep that. So, however far I go, it's going to be a first try thing. Oh, boy. That is going to hurt. Oh, that's going to hurt, man. Oh, that's really going to hurt. Please don't super me at the beginning. Please don't super me at the beginning. That is going to hurt quite a bit. Quite a bit. What do we have next turn? Next turn, we have green, green. Okay, so next turn is going to be all right. But, oof. If, if this doesn't... Uh, if uh, don't get super don't get supered I'm gonna do this with no items I'm really gonna push for it but I might have to I can't have my video being like five minutes long where I just get completely nuked uh, okay Whew. we're good if he supers the physical Vegeta blue that's fine that's not a big deal but anyway um, also thank you to all of you tunes who participated on the previous tune lock challenge uh, some of you posted videos screenshots uh, it was very cool of you guys to participate and yeah, again, you know, because there's not as much going on, having little challenges like this here and there, it's fun. But I want to reiterate the fact that when I'm issuing a challenge, I'm not doing it under the pretense that I did it first and that I'm better. Because I know better than to challenge the internet. There's always somebody better than you, right? So instead of trying to pretend like, oh, I got the best, I'm the best, beat this, like you'll never beat it. No, I'm, I'm under the assumption that you guys can and will beat me. It's just more of a question of if you would participate. So, if you're bored, you got nothing else to do, go ahead and give this a try. So, we've got Vegito Blue now out here. Unfortunately, we've got Candy... Actually, you know what? Candy Vegito being uh, 
a regular unit is actually probably good because we need him to stack. If we somehow make it all the way to MUI, we're going to need... Yeah, we're definitely going to need him to be able to, to take a few hits. Because I remember Jay Fanta, when he did his uh, no item free to play, he got to a point against MUI where he had to pick up like six or seven orbs each turn with Candy Vegito to simply survive normal hits. So, we might... Okay. We might end up in a similar situation. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Once again, no items as of right now. First try. I promise the first try. And Toon Lock. Nothing has changed. No rotations have changed. Three supers? Oh my god. Does anybody here have to... S oh boy, you know what? Actually, now that I think about this, I don't think this can be possible. I don't think this is possible to get done unless you're lucky enough to have the Candy Vegito... Hmm. The Candy Vegito... See, the Candy Vegito needs to be able to stack long enough. And with the rate that we're going, I don't think that's actually going to be possible. So here... We're just going to focus on the Dokkan Gauge again. If he supers, great. If he doesn't, no big deal. We'll pick up these reds for the Vegito, and then we'll pick up these blues for that Vegito. If the Rainbow Int doesn't get an additional, then the SCR will definitely take care of it. Yeah, there you go. So, no transformation as of yet for either STR unit. We haven't needed it. Uh, in fact, that's probably a good thing, because if we're running this no items, we have three, we have three free items built into our passives. All right, so here, oh my gosh. This is not gonna be pretty. Look at all of those attacks coming in. If he supers at the beginning, that is gonna hurt so much. That's gonna hurt so much. If he could maybe wait till attacking Candy Vegito, that would be better. All right, one counter. Two counter. A one, two, three. Blah. A one, two, no! 165k unnecessary damage. Oh man, are we gonna heal? Are we gonna, yeah, we're gonna get an STR Vegito next turn. Oh, you know what, we don't have to. We don't have to, it's not a, it's not a force transformation. It's an active skill. Oh, look at all these attacks. Dude, just imagine if he went first. Imagine if he went first. That's three super attacks, right? Imagine if he went first and then countered all that. Also, the super wouldn't have done as much. So there's our stack. And that's it. No additional stack. And he dodges. All right. So this next turn, we're going to have two STR Vegetas on rotation. Both will have the active skill available. I don't think we want to pick it up because we're close to a Dokkan attack. And the Dokkan attack is going to heal us. Although, maybe having one might be good. Maybe having one might be... I don't know. I don't know. This is my first time ever doing this kind of a thing. And uh, I don't know. Let's see. There's one. There's two. Ooh. Ooh. See, if, if we transform the guy... Yeah, no, I think we should, though. No, he can force the... No, no, no. No, 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 Yes. <laughs> yes. We have to. We have to. We have, we have an AGL Vegito. Uh, we have some unreliable units when it comes to defense, so yeah, we should. We are going to be getting a Dokkan attack coming up, but let's get one Vegito out here. We don't need the second one. We'll, we'll keep the second one for a just in case, you know, an emergency situation. But let's have one. Let's have one. So that heals us. And so now for 10 turns, we're going to have the scouting mechanic. And there you go. So now we know that the super is going to hit the middle guy. That's important. So Vegito goes first. He can counter like crazy. We'll have the Int Vegito do the same. Th well, he can't counter, but he'll use a super and absorb the hit. This is going to make uh, things very easy. And also, this will clear up the doubt whether or not the scouting mechanic works when the Vegeta's not on rotation. Because there's been some confusion, probably mainly by me, where certain other units, like the Android 1415, for example, the free-to-play unit, in his passive, it says that for the rest of the fight, you can see all attacks. The wording is different where it's very explicit and clear that whether or not the Android 14 or 15 are on rotation, you can still see all the attacks. You can scout everything. But for this guy, the Super Vegito STR, it's not clear. So it's more of a trial and error type thing. People have said that it works when he's off rotation, so we're going to find that out because I don't think I've ever actually tested that. So we'll see if we can scout the attacks. So now we've got blue. 
We're already on blue. It's actually pretty good. In 10 minutes, we got to blue. Yes. So the stack is permanent. And we've got the AGL. Oh, my God. We've got the AGL. Oh, dude. I'm about to take so much damage. No. We're going to take so much damage. Bro. Oh, this is going to hurt. This is going to hurt so much. I better I better use the Dokkan attack. I better use the Dokkan attack. That's important. <laughs> I'm going to get blasted, dude. Oh, I'm gonna get destroyed. Okay, let's actually do this. And let's give all of these orbs to the Candy Vegito so that he can have a little bit more strength if he were to get slapped. Oh my gosh, this is gonna hurt so much. We're gonna counter like two hits and then we're gonna get blasted for like at least 200, 300k minimum. Super Vegito has no defense. His damage mitigation comes from slaps, not from supers. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Now I'm questioning, did I ever change rotations? I'm actually really nervous. I hope I didn't. I really hope I didn't, because if I did, this whole video is useless. I really hope I didn't. <laughs> Future me, please let me know. Did I? <laughs> oh god, this is gonna hurt! Mm, 300k, 400k, 300k. 250. Dude, that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Oh man. Alright. So, next. Oh dude, you know what? I think the Vegito. The Infigita is going to trigger. So we're going to be using up that heal. That sucks. We're using up that heal. Because we're below 50%. It's on turn 8. Oh, yeah. We're definitely getting it. Definitely. Next turn, we got Candy Vegito. No, not Candy Vegito. We got the STR Vegito. We got the STR Super Vegito. And then we've got the Int one. Yep. We're transforming next turn. That sucks. So we only have one item left in the... <laughs> In the span of, like, one turn, we went from three items to zero in terms of, like, passives and effects and all that. That's unfortunate. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa. Oh, the Dokkan attack saved us. The Dokkan attack saved us. That's crazy. Oh, that's crazy. Okay. I'll take that. I'll take that. So, let's go ahead and bring, uh, let's bring down the purple orbs. Yeah. So, there you go. So now Vegito's going to be going, Super Vegito's going to be going, and then Int Vegito can get those at the end. I think we'll probably take him out this turn. I think so. Hopefully we do, because I don't think we can handle another... Oh, wait. Yeah, he's. we're not getting supered. I don't think I saw anything. So we're, we're not getting supered here. So these are all going to be just, just be slaps. Man, that, that ability is now really coming in clutch, isn't it? Especially for no items and whatnot. That's like cheating. <laughs> It, and especially if you're going to be blitzing through the event, 10 turns is actually a really, really long time. Because you'd probably average like 2 or 3 turns per per form. And obviously it's not going to be for every form because like the earlier ones are easy. So this could honestly last you the entire fight. I think people have already said that it does. But I've, this is my first time trying this, so we'll find... We're already at... Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're 13 minutes in. We're all... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... I think, you know what, we're just going to go ahead and go through with it. We're just going to go through with it. So, uh, we're going to trigger the second one. We have no Dokkan attacks. So we might as well do this. We're going to heal whatever health we're missing. We're going to be at full health, and we're operating at 100% now. We've got two Vegitos on deck, two Super Vegitos. All that's missing is the Int one. So, barring any emergency, we're just going to keep him as is. But we're about to do a lot of damage. A lot of damage, because... Yeah. STR is going to go first. AGL is going to go second. Thank God the physical one's going last. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? If we... <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh, this is going to be good. 80k, that's it? Oh, dude. Okay, just don't, don't, don't super, don't super, don't super. Oh, wait, no, he's not supering until after. Oh, he is supering, though. He's supering my Super Vegito. That's not good. That is not good. Hopefully, we can stack a couple of times. Is this my Vegito, or is this the rainbow one? If this is the rainbow one, we've got a pretty decent shot at a couple additionals, because I believe in the skills, he used a level 5. <laughs> 260. Wow. 260k, that's a lot. We might trigger the Patara next turn. Oh, we're definitely... Do we have Patara coming up? Oh, dude. Could we even survive? I don't think we can. We're going to have to use an item next turn. Oh, that sucks. That makes me sad. That makes me sad. We'll find out. We'll find out. Because Inpatara is not coming up until the turn after. So we might have to use an item to preserve the video. 
That's unfortunate. Oh, and he dodged the super. All right, second super, you're gonna dodge this too? Oh my god, he did! What the hell? All right, so what do we got? No supers. Okay. We've got no supers. We just have to dodge. Now, do we trust Candy Vegito to dodge all this? I don't know, man. I don't know. 70% chance to dodge. I kind of want to do it. Honestly, I kind of want to do it. Alright, so... <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm going through with it, man. I'm going through with it. Candy Vegeta's going to dodge all of it. Watch. We're going to pick up these key spheres just to heal whatever we can. If we get hit once, we're dead. Candy Vegeta's going to dodge everything, though. Watch this. Watch this. No sweat. One. Two. Three. Oh, no! Oh, God. You got to dodge. Bro. Dodge. One more. One. <laughs> oh, dude. I think we're dead. I don't think we can survive this. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, if we can just survive this turn, we'll be fine. Come on. More supers. More supers. Oh, it's going to suck. It's going to suck. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, man. Please give me an additional. One additional. Just one additional. I think we'll be fine. One additional. One more. One more. One more. Am I dead? <laughs> how did, how long? We survived with 2,000 health. 2,403 health. Yes! Oh, the run lives on. The run lives on. Okay, the super's coming up in the middle. Okay. We just got so lucky. Oh, that might be the luckiest break I've ever seen in Dokkan. I don't think I've ever seen a luckier break than that. Oh my god. All right, so we're, we are we should be out of here before we even get to the STR Vegito. Because these counters should take care of him. Oh, wow. Never mind. Never mind. All right, so the, we're going to have to have a couple supers take care of him. So there, Wait, what? what? Oh, right. Criticals do more. Right. Okay. That was confusing. Uh, but yeah, he, he's dead. He's dead for sure. So here we go. First super attack. Uh, if this doesn't kill him, the second one will. And boom. We're on the final stage. First try, man. First try. 2,403. Oh, we got so lucky. Look at the rotation. Oh, man. Can... Dude. Can we actually do this? Is this... It might be possible. It might be possible. Okay. So we got to... Huh. All right, we got to do this. And then we got to do this. And then we'll give the Vegito at the end. Oh, the Vegito at the end is the scary part. Oh, no, no, but he's only he's supering at the beginning, so it's fine. It's fine. So this is going to hurt, but it's not going to hurt nearly as much as what would have happened if Candy Vegito. If Candy Vegito was to go first, we would literally have to use an item. Like, there's no way out of it. So 126, that is, that is totally acceptable. I'm fine with that. Dude, look at these counters, though. Without any supers, we do 282. Man. That's not good. All right. This is this is where we earn our keep. It's really honestly up to the physical Vegito Blue. He's got to do these supers. Like, there's... Yeah, okay. So two out of three so far. Can we get a... Oh, can we get one more? Nope, that's it. All right, so two supers. He does 95k on a punish. Okay. KVG is going to do nothing. Oh, he's going to boost? Okay. Better late than never. Kenny Vegeta's really not going to help at all. In fact, he will be the reason why we lose, probably. Uh, if not him, this guy. <laughs> Cause he, well, no. You know what? I, I don't think I'm giving enough credit. While he does have type disadvantage, he's going to do a ton of damage himself, and he's going to do at least two supers. So he might actually be able to mitigate quite a bit of damage, even though he's got type disadvantage, because that was two right there. And look at that. He does 69 on a on a slap. That's, that's really good. That's really, really, really good. 13 turns in. First try. No item. Tune lock. Oh. oh, I don't know how I feel about that. The middle looks pretty scary. Okay, so we gotta do this. Ultra super. We gotta do this. No ultra super. And we gotta do this. This could be the end of our run. This could be the end of our run. 15k on a slap. That's not good. That's gonna be crucial damage that we can't get back on that super that's coming up. 
Ooh, and he's dodging all of our counters, too. Oh, these counters are, would do a lot of damage if you would actually get hit. Come on. 1.2 mil? Dude, this is really good. This is a really good run. First try. I, I want people to understand. First try. So even if we fail this, this was actually an incredible run. I would have never thought I would have got this. Like, this is incredible. Absolutely incredible. I wish we could have got an additional there. That would have been so great. These counters are going to hurt as long as they hit. There's a hit. 400k. Okay. He, there's no critical on that one. That's fine. He dodged that counter. Thank you. He's going to dodge this one. Nope. That is a solid outing. We brought MUI to below half. That is really good. I don't care how spectacularly we fail at the end here. That is truly an achievement. We did a really good job, team. Good job, team. Really good. You guys get the idea. This is gonna do. This is gonna do 350 at least. 246. Okay. Okay. Can we get those additionals, man? Can we get them? I would love it if I could brag on the thumbnail. <gasps> Oh my god. We might actually do this. We might actually do this. Oh my god. We might actually do this. Can we finally achieve it? And by finally, I mean for the first time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Should we pick up? No. We should pick up the... No. What do we pick up? If we pick up three... Let's do some math real quick. If we pick up three tech, we get attack and defense. Oh, it, it doesn't matter. We get, it's, it's an or situation, so it doesn't matter. Let's pick up these, because we get more defense. This is where we lose. This is indeed where we lose if we don't kill him before that. But if we can kill him, that would be so incredible. Oh, okay, so we, we gave him a boost. We gave the Vegito Blue. This is all dependent on Vegito. Everything rides on Vegito Blue. If Vegito Blue can hit with... <laughs>
as you can see, I lucked out. But if you're able to do that and you have the you have the honor, you know, and if you're if you're okay with telling the truth and saying, you know what, I did try it, I failed in the first time. Second time I got it, that's totally fine. But if you're able to get on the first try, that's incredible. <sighs> there you have it. Showcase complete. My assessment on the Vegitos is that they are stupidly broken, they are stupidly good, and I love it! So thank you so much for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed this, I, I'm sure you did, I demand you leave a like down below. And let me know in the comments your results on these runs. I'm going to post a tweet as well, so if you want to post your results on Twitter as well, feel free to. Follow me on Twitter, at ToonRami. Link will be in the description. Or just let me know your thoughts in general about the run. Did you think I was going to make it? Did you think that I was going to lose at Blue, Super Saiyan 3? What was your guess? And what the heck was that ending? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more dope content in the future. And... Click the notification bell so that you let YouTube know you want to see more of my stuff. Dude, I can't even get over this, man. First try. Rotations didn't change! And I won on one critical counter. That is going down in the history books. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Stay tuned, and always remember to Dokkan responsibly. Holy sh**.